it's summertime and we all love a good block party and the Westmoreland Museum of American Art is actually celebrating the block party with their incredible latest exhibit. And to tell us more about it, we're actually here with the Director of Marketing and Public Relations, Claire Ertel. Good to see you, Claire. Hi. Hi, Daisy. Thanks now, for being here. I'm so fascinated by this because, of course, this brings back such good feelings of summertime and community and celebration. So tell us more about the block party. Block Party Community and Celebration in American Art was organized by our chief curator, Jeremiah William McCarthy, and it really um, uses the lens of the Block Party to look at artists' um, ideas on community and celebration in both historical and contemporary works of American art. So it features nearly 75 works by close to 30 artists, and you, there's everything ranging from video to tapestry to sculpture to paintings, of course. Um, and it's really bright and color, colorful, so I think everyone will enjoy coming here on a hot summer day and um, th just love the joyfulness of the galleries. The exhibition really started when a coworker told me that this year was the 250th anniversary of Westmoreland County. And we became obsessed with this idea of how do we have a party for the county uh, through an exhibition. And so I started researching parties, which have a really long history. Um, but one of the most important kind of chapters in that history is the development of block parties, which start kind of around World War I. Um, and they're because people have very few resources, so they kind of take to the streets um, to have a good time and to celebrate things. And joining me now is one of the visual artists here in the exhibit. We have Paige Henry. And Paige, you work a lot with metal, so can you describe to me uh, your pieces of art that are here? Yeah, so this sculpture is called Slush Ball. It's cast bronze using um, a technique that makes it hollow without making a core. And um, it's probably 20 pounds of bronze. Wow. That's incredible. Now, I'm really intrigued by this. Describe to me what we have going on here. Yeah, so this is part of a like snapshot or moment in time series, and it's cast iron. All the pieces are just one casting, and it probably weighs around 200 pounds. Oh my gosh, and I love the name of this. What's the name of this again? It's called Puked Purse. Puked Purse. Well, I love how creative you are. These are so amazing, and well, I'm excited you. to check out the rest of the block party here, and hope you all can too. What a fun way to celebrate this too. Absolutely, right? it's a great idea. Block party, community and celebration in American art will be on view through September 17th at the Westmoreland Museum of American Art and even better, admission is free. And for more info, just go to our website, pittsburghtodaylive.com.